Hey, what's up guys? It's Shane, the Rising Grind Picker. And today I'm just gonna do a short video and I'm gonna kind of cover a topic that no one really covers because I don't know why, I guess they're afraid to. I don't really care about flak back. I don't give a shit about anything like that. So let's get into this video. I'm an online six-figure seller. Uh, I sell on eBay, mainly lightly on Amazon. Just started back lightly on Amazon. And well, I want to cover a topic today about why you see all these YouTubers getting jobs. Uh, you see it like there was like four of them in a row that's like, hey guys, we're getting jobs. Well, here's why. So what I want to say is a lot of, a lot of YouTubers, uh, a lot of reselling YouTubers have been getting jobs in the last few months. And I feel like here's why. A lot of YouTubers or a lot of reselling YouTubers on YouTube don't really resell that much. They have barely a thousand a thousand items in their store. They, uh, a lot of them have less than a thousand items. And I haven't found anyone on YouTube besides like one or two people, maybe three people that have more items than I do. And, and I'm not saying that like, oh, I'm the best. I'm not that great. Like I am not that smart. Like I'm not the smartest person in the room. I, I just work my ass off. Right. So I guess what I really want to say is like, you really got to watch who you follow because not everyone on YouTube is a great reseller. 90% of the people on YouTube are shitty resellers. And that's just my opinion. But, but there are really great, a, a lot of great resellers on YouTube that do list, but there's also a lot, I, I would say 85 to 90% that literally have an under a thousand items or an under 300 items in their store. And you know, the thing is, is if you want to do this business. There's two ways to do it. You can either go very low inventory, very high sell through, very high, very high profitability, right? Or you can go tons of items, crap tons of items in your store. Um, mediocre sell through, run sales, and, and, and my base sales on eBay right now is, I don't know, 500-ish and I have 4,300 items. So my goal is to go 10,000 items by the end of the year. And then that should give me like, I don't know, uh, maybe a thousand, maybe 800 base sales, six, 700, I don't know, ish. But this is what happens. You blow up on YouTube, I blew up on YouTube, and I was making crazy YouTube money. And I'm talking like seven to 8,000 in AdSense a month. And that was three years ago when no one was doing YouTube. And eventually with YouTube, there's a lot of roller coasters, there's ups and downs, and your AdSense, no matter who you are, you can be the best YouTuber on the planet. You could be Harry Tornado, and eventually your viewership is going to dwindle and die down. It always happens to everyone, and then it goes back up and it goes back down. If you're not really reselling, and you're not actually listing stuff on eBay, or making money on Amazon or where, wherever it is. Well, when your YouTube revenue dies, you're gonna have to get a job. That's how it works if you're not really selling. But if you're following a YouTuber for entertainment and it's strictly entertainment, right? And you are copying what they're doing, you need to look at their eBay store or Amazon store and you need to realize, should you, I mean, it's okay to watch someone for entertainment. I get it. 100% freaking okay. I do it all the time. But you can't copy the business model if it don't work. That's what I'm saying. I'm not doing this video to hate on anyone. I'm not doing this video to be like, ha, 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 ha. No, I'm doing it because I, I care about people and I want you to understand if you follow my channel, like you are gonna get a legit experience. I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot it to you a hundred percent straight. Yes, a lot of YouTube is entertainment and I get that. But a lot of people are watching these YouTubers 
and they're like, I'm gonna follow them. I'm gonna do exactly what they're doing. And they're getting jobs. Not everyone is, but I'm saying several people are. 